So now we continue and we have three wines. We start off with a 2013 Pinot Gris, followed by a 2014 Pinot Gris. And that's interesting to see how these wines um, actually are different, as they're a little bit older. I'm starting with the 2013 Pinot Gris, but you can sometimes turn it around. You could start as well with the 2014. Nose is like a little bit of cow stable, dried hay. Um, it's actually very pleasant. Has personality, considering this is a very young wine. Is nice acidity, minerality, has a nice chew, has an acquired taste, but still is very pleasant, very, very nice. So I like the chew, the way it grabs, very fresh, great for summer. Uh, a, a lovely, lovely wine. I would give this, I would score this um, 81 points. Why? Because it is um, very, very fresh, nice build, acquired taste. I quite like it. Um, and I think also for the price of six euros, it's, it's, it's a steal. Come on, let's be honest. This is a very nice bottle of wine. So if we then continue with its younger, or no, yeah, younger brother. It's 2014 Pinot Gris as well. And let's have a look. So if we look at the Pinot Gris from this perspective, it has, has, has some more fruit in the nose, very different. So it's not the dry grass, it's not, not the other, let's say, characteristics. Definitely more fruit. Strong minerality, um, it's quite okay. Um, I would score it from this perspective, because I, I, I really prefer the, the older one. It's always nice when wine comes together, has a little bit more time, 79, 80 points. It, it, it's an acquired taste, you have to enjoy it. So I say, when you're here, try it out, see what you think of it. It's uh, always, there are many opinions and taste is a very, let's say, multi-dimensional subject. Taste is something you can discuss forever. These are my tasting notes and that's how I view it, but uh, I welcome other opinions because I do like the freshness of it. So and now we go to the next wine, which is a rosé. It's a rosé from Pinot Noir. And let's have a look. So, I mean, first of all, the color. She looks beautiful orange. Very fresh, um, it's, it's really a summer rosé, so this is for the summer months, so if you're barbecuing, creamy, um, let's say dishes, this is very, very pleasant. It has like this wonderful acidity, very low fruit, it's like a very, let's say, one-dimensional wine, but that's not bad, you know. Considering the price point, this is great. I mean, if you just want to have a nice barbecue, nice sausage, uh, something very, let's say, some spicy oriental foods, this is okay, you can mix it, you can pick and mix. But the wine is okay, and I, I would score it from that perspective 83 points.